This right here is a night lock and it makes the door almost impossible to open. They're made right here in Michigan in Mount Morris, which is just 30 miles from Oxford High School where tragedy struck back in November. Let's get to Priya Mann tonight uh, to not just show us how they work, but how demand soared for these this summer, Priya. Yeah, absolutely, Jason, Karen, and the numbers here really tell the story. Since the Oxford mass shooting, Nightlock has gained 1167 new customers. They've worked with 151 school districts across Michigan and installed 1400 of those locks right here in Troy. The school district preparing to welcome students back next Tuesday. Our in-depth look at these security devices takes us to Genesee County. Right after the Uvalde shooting, uh, June picked up and it's been nonstop. This summer has been the busiest on record for Nightlock, a security device provider in mid-Michigan. You take a phone call and you have five emails while you're on the phone and it's been like that. It started in December with Oxford and it really hasn't let up since. A quarter of Nightlock's annual sales were shipped just in June, and owners believe the tragic school shootings in Oxford and Uvalde, as well as school districts wanting to prepare for the upcoming school year, contributed to the dramatic increase in sales. Now these four skids sitting here are going to West Virginia. One of them's going to Dallas. Based in Mount Morris, Nightlock is less than an hour from Oxford High School, which had their devices in place. Knowing that our door barricades were on those doors and watching those kids in those classrooms, um, it just felt good that our door locks were protecting kids. There's no degree of separation in Oakland County from that tragedy. Somebody knew somebody that was in the building and we knew other fellow administrators over there and undoubtedly the first thing they told us was thank God for night lock, it saved lives. Within days, Rick West, the assistant superintendent of the Troy School District, ordered more than 1,600 locks. It's a sad reality, so as school administrators, our job is to provide solutions for the realities that we face. Classroom and office doors adjacent to hallways were identified as vulnerabilities. Pull the device. You simply put it in the mechanism. If you were pulling on that, you're going to be unable to access the classroom. Since the Oxford mass shooting, 150 school districts across the state have ordered security devices from Nightlock. The mid-Michigan company is now rolling out new safety products. During an active shooter event, the protocol says lock the door, turn out the lights, cover the window. So we have blackout shades uh, that we patented and um, we started selling about a year and a half ago and they're really popular. They've also created an early alert notification system so that when a security lock is activated, teachers, administrators, and law enforcement are immediately notified. You have to stay on the cutting edge of things for security purposes. I mean, if you're not evolving and creating new products, then you're not doing your best to protect them. You gotta keep trying, you gotta keep pushing forward. Every lock helps. Maureen Castle is an assembly worker during the summer months, but during the school year, she's a cook at an elementary school in Genesee County. And she says the work she does at school and here in the warehouse is making a difference. It's just another solution, even if it helps just a few, you know, it's worth it. They developed a rather easy device that saves lives. And hearing that testimony again from Oxford, it was, it was a no brainer. They are saving lives in this country. And Nightlock security devices are in 3,000 school districts nationwide. That's about 15,000 schools. Now, this story is part of a series we call Solutionaries. It's a digital in-depth look at solutions to issues that are affecting all of us. You can see our segment called Safer Schools tomorrow at 8 p.m. on YouTube and Local 4 Plus. Reporting live here in Troy, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. Yeah, simple and smart solution for sure. Before you go, Priya, do you know how long it took Troy to get those installed? Yeah, I asked the same thing, Jason. It took about a month. Uh, the Troy School District called Nightlock around December, mid-December, and by the end of January, they had them all installed. And when you think about 1,400 locks at every school across this district, that is no simple task. Yeah, send it back to you. for sure. All right, Priya, we appreciate it.